can't remember how to do this. I'm so tired. Um, what's up, guys? That pro wrestling dude YT I'm here with Colin again. He isn't gonna shout shit out this time. Um, this is the December pro wrestling crate box. Pro wrestling loot has not even shipped yet. They're having issues with shipping, which is kind of bullshit because they charge me again for the next box without even fucking shipping this box yet. Um, but each box has two autographs in it. I can't remember if they said two brawlers for this one. I, I know Pro Wrestling Loot has two brawlers and two autographs. I'm not sure if they have two brawlers in this one. Um, but they definitely have two autographs. I can't remember who's in it. I remember the autographs, I believe. I'll take a guess. Like I always do. I'm not going to shout it out. But fucking... <laughs> you look fucking starstruck. Like. Um, I can't remember who's all in the box, but I remember the Lucha Bros are in the box. I I feel like they're gonna be the autographs. Like that just makes sense to me because like two autographs, Aren't tag team. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. So I just, this does I just, have AEW stuff. In yeah, it. I mean it can have that stuff in it. It's just not the AEW box. The okay. AEW box is like all big names, you know. Um, just but. Stop. Okay, <laughs> I just got the uh, Ray Fenix and Pentagon, uh, I think it's Unrivaled figures, the black and gold, I fucking love them, and I had to get them, I saw them in the store and was like, yo, so, where was it at? It was, a uh, the Walmart in Hermitage, okay, it's fucking nice, they had a lot of shit, like, the only time I've ever seen fucking AW figures, we live in a small ass town and it's bullshit, so, that's, okay. Yeah. Spoiler alert, the other side of this card contains the contents of this crate. Next month's crate features Adam Cole, Dan Rick Fire, Bret Hart, Matt Cardona, Johnny Gargano, Tony Nese, IRS, but IRS, plus a special item from Pro Wrestling Gorilla. Who's that? I don't know what Pro Wrestling Gorilla is. It must be like a... I don't know. You're like shouting very hard on that. Oh, shit. Good luck. He <laughs> saved that. Don't look at the card. Um, I don't think they'd be able to read it there anyways. I fucking wouldn't be able to. I don't know. Unless they're really trying and, like, ruin it for themselves. Um, so Adam Cole, Ric Flair, Bret Hart are three fucking amazing names from that. Matt Cardona, Johnny Gargano, Tony Nese. All right. And then IRS is, like, so. Uh, yeah, and then on the back, there's the fucking answers that I probably just showed you guys. So, first we're going to do the little brawler ball. I don't know who the fuck... That's a Rey Mysterio one right there. Who the fuck's on the other side? I don't remember Rey Mysterio. Who is that? Do you know? I don't know. <clears throat> oh, that's Lucha Bros. That's not Rey Mysterio. Yeah. When, did, when did Rey Phoenix or Pentagon ever get the fucking cross on their forehead? Who's going to be the autograph? Ooh, fuck, he's not gonna... I'm kind of upset, though, because I wanted Lucha Bros. I wanted their autograph. Okay, that sucks. Um, Yeah, I don't remember Ray... Or, er, yeah, Ray Fenix ever having the fucking cross. You know, that one's cool. I actually just sold my... uh all, or Not Ultimate Warrior. Road Warriors one uh, for, like, seven bucks. And I got a few boxes ago. It's pretty dope. Let's see. I like Lucha Bros, so. But it's I mean, they should have made them like the same color, I feel like. I don't know. Perhaps. I don't know. We're going to do the first shirt. Oh, that second shirt looks nice. Alright. Who the fuck? Oh, that's Kevin Steen. Kevin Owens. Oh, is it really? Kill Steen Q. I don't know what the actual shirt it is. It says Steen. What the fuck does it say? Is this Kevin Owens? Does that say Steen Wolf? Yeah. It's Steen Wolf. Like, Teen Wolf. Steen Wolf. Yeah. I heard he's leaving WWE. Very soon. Look at him. He looks like a baby in that. Yeah. yeah, yeah he doesn't yeah. look stressed and pissed off at WWE all the time. That's yeah. a nice little shirt. That one looks good. Yeah, I know. I love the blue ones. They always choose, like, the best blue. Like, like the Kenny oh, Omega. Like the too. Kenny Omega shirt they did. In the old boxes. 
Damn. Alright. So that looks like a mix. Oh, oh, yeah, oh that's, that's fucking nice. Dope. That's nice. That's dope. Who's the fourth face? Santa. That's who it yeah, is. Yeah, Santa. I was like, damn, who's that? I know the three, but yeah, that's awesome. Four faces of Foley. There's fucking Cactus Jack, Dude Love, Mankind, and Santa. That's fucking that's awesome. That's awesome, bro. That's probably one of the coolest shirts they've sent in these boxes. Yeah, that's keep fucking, that one. Yeah, oh, fuck yeah, I'm keeping that one. That one's cool. I really enjoyed that. That was nice. I forgot Mick Foley was in this box. Okay, we're going to do the pin next. So, I think it's the pin. Who the hell... Uh, awesome that, Kong. Yeah, I was gonna from say that's TNA. Awesome Kong. Damn, you got that pretty good. Yeah. Yeah, it's Awesome that's, Kong. That's awesome. That's not just awesome. That's Awesome <laughs> Kong. All right. So let's do the comic next. This box is kind of like I feel like it's empty. Like we're almost done. It's just kind of like the main things this time. There's no like side thing like there usually is. Like there's usually like just some random item that's pretty cool. There's not one in here. I'm kind of upset. Who the fuck is that? I don't know. Let's see. Tales from the Road. Murder, Death, Pringle. Co-created by Nick Gage. That's that guy that fucking cut uh, Moxley with a pizza cutter on oh, AEW. Man. Right when that fucking... Dom you remember that? The Domino's commercial was playing and they do that side-by-side -side fucking... Yeah, where it shows yeah, the matches and, that, and, the, and he's yeah. sitting there slicing Dude. Jericho's head open with a pizza cutter. It and was Domino's. Moxley's. Wasn't yeah, it Moxley's head. Or no, no, it was Jericho's. Okay. Sorry, Moxley and him had stuff in GCW. Um, yeah, it was Jericho, and he's slicing Jericho's head open on fucking AEW, and Domino's is playing <laughs> on the other side with a pizza cutter, he's cutting their pizza and shit, and they fucking went nuts, bro. Yeah. Okay. So, I mean. It's a comic book. I've never actually read one of these that they sent. Um, not a comic person. But people usually buy them from me. So, I mean... Whatever. Okay. So, we got, the, we got the brawler next. And that is that fucking Glacier dude. I never actually watched Glacier. We're kind of young for that. I don't that. even know who he is. He's from WCW. He's like a Sub-Zero ripoff. Uh-oh. Like... Kind of like when WCW did all kinds of dumb shit. Um, but, yeah, Glacier, he'll probably not sell. I'm going to be honest. Like five bucks. Yeah, I mean, he, he's probably not. Some gonna... collector that has every other brawler but him. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Most of them will just already have the box, you know what I mean? But yeah, it's it's a pretty cool little figure. It's just not anything special. It's Glacier. Um Okay, so who else is in the box? We have the auto last, but I want to try to figure out who it is before I... There's two of them. I know. I don't know who... I don't know. I don't, didn't read your card last month. So I don't yeah, know. I don't know. I can't remember who's even in the... That's a thick-ass picture, though. Holy fuck. This is a hefty picture. Oh, there's two. Yeah, two. Oh, I thought it'd be two on the same. I didn't think about that because I thought Lucha Bros yeah. already, so I thought two on the same thing. Awesome. Okay, so we'll do this one first. EC3? Oh, that's that's cool. I okay. like that one. EC3's beast. I don't see the autograph. Oh, it's small as fuck up there. That's kind of trash. Oh, that's a cool autograph, though. Is that a good What? That's his autograph. No, I mean, that's a good picture, though. Oh. I was going to say, it's just EC3 in English. I could do that. I could fucking forge that shit. EC3. Yeah. <laughs> Ten bucks. All right, so that's not bad. It's not one of the ones that you bought, so I'm not better. Okay. Hopefully this one's a little bit better. It's fucking Christmas. Come on, guys. Like this is last. Brian Pillman Jr. We were just talking about him. Yeah, we were last night. <laughs> hey, dude, that's awesome. Hell yeah. All right, that one's cool. I'm not mad about that one. That one's all right. That's cool. I guess that makes sense. That saves the money and shit, and they can put money into the shirts and... Yeah, okay, so they still have to make money on the box, so, yeah. Okay. Oh, look, it's got the little sticker. Yeah, that's just saying it's verified by them that it's real. See, that's nice. I feel like that's a nice autograph, but at the same time, I'm like, it kind of just looks like he just did some trying I don't like that it's sideways. 
I like sideways ones. It looks neat. really. I like them better, like up and down, for when they're in your booklet and shit, and like people are looking yeah, at them. Yeah, I just because then you gotta like. Yeah. Oh, you mean like sideways? Well, like, yeah, like I like, like it like that. Yeah, like I wish yeah, it was like that. I, I, I don't like that. I like those ones too. Yeah, um, I do like that. That's a cool. Autograph I thought you meant like the way he did it. Oh like no, 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 no. That's that's nice. I like that autograph. Yeah. That's a big nice autograph. I thought yeah, I thought you meant when people twist their hand to do autographs. I was no, like, that looks no. I meant like shit. the picture. Yeah, I fucking hate that. Yeah, Cause I don't. Because then not, you gotta like turn yeah, your shit. Yeah, you gotta be like, all right, yeah, yeah. Then I can that. Okay. Or if you put them in frames or something, you gotta put one this way and then one this way, and yeah, then it looks, and it looks ridiculous. Dumb, yeah, yeah, I, I like them like that. Wish it were like that. All right, so it's not a bad boss. Pro wrestling loot. I don't know when that's shipping. I definitely like the shirt. Yeah. That oh, the that McFoley awesome. shirt was pretty lit. Yeah, that's probably the best thing in the rock. Oh fuck, I'm tired. Ah oh, shit. Yeah, this shirt's probably the best. Definitely the best thing in the box. Um, what was the black one? That was the Kevin Owens Steen Wolf. Okay, Kevin got Owens. Steen Wolf. Okay. I mean, that'll probably sell for like fifteen. Or I ain't gonna sell the shirt though. Yeah. Actually, I keep the shirts in this box. Pro Wrestling Loot. I'll sell them because they always give me shitty shirts, like terrible ones. And I'm like, nah, I don't even care. Okay, so we're going to do. It's eleven minutes in. We're gonna do a guess of what next month can be. So we got Adam Cole, Ric Flair, Bret Hart, Matt Cardona, Johnny Gargano, Tony Nese, IRS, and then Pro Wrestling Gorilla. Pro Wrestling Gorilla will probably be a fucking DVD or a comic. A special item from IRS will probably be... Oh, probably be something... One of the special things, like how they did Brutus Barber Beefcake's uh, grooming kit... I bet this will be like an IRS checkbook or something. Well, not like checkbook, but like something like that, if that makes sense. I'm going to say an Adam Cole signature. That would be nice, but I just don't see them going all out with it like that. Yeah, I... It's not going to be Hart. It'll probably be a Bret Hart brawler. Ric Flair charges like $80 for a fucking signature, so I doubt it's him. I don't know. I don't see Ric Flair having a shirt. Johnny in there. Gargano would be cool because he just left NXT. And I think he's done wrestling for a bit because of his kid. It would probably be someone stupid like Tony Nese. Um, no disrespect. It's just the worst name on here. Um, well, besides the IRS. Um, Matt Cardona is probably something. I'd say a Ric Flair shirt. That makes sense. Something about Space Mountain, hopefully. Um, I bet an Adam Cole shirt. Something about Baby. Adam Cole, and it has like Baby or something. Fucking. <clears throat> and then Bret Hart, Brawler. I just see an Adam Cole Brawler, too. I just feel like they try to go for colorful Brawlers like this. Like, they weren't going to choose, like, Mick Foley because yeah. he's not real colorful. I feel like the shirt's going to be Tony Nese and probably Adam Cole because they're usually popular, but not, like, popular, popular people. Well, that was Kevin Owens and Bret Hart. Or, Kevin yeah, Owens Mick and Foley. Mick Foley. Yeah, fuck this. That was decent. Kenny Omega. Yeah, they do his shirts and shit. Um, so, I don't know. I'll stick by my Bret Hart, Brawler, Ric Flair, Adam Cole shirts. I want to say a Johnny Gargano fucking autograph. Um, something like a checkbook or something from IRS. I'd say a Tony Nese. No, Matt Cardona pin. And Tony Nese fucking. Huh, I don't know. Something from Tony Nese. And then the Pro Wrestling Gorilla, that'll probably be like DVD or Connor. Um, I'd assume, which is a pretty good fucking guess. Um, okay, so, this, this month's charity was Mary Kay Anthony GoFundMe, Steen Wolf Kevin Steen t-shirt, Four Faces of Foley Mick Foley t-shirt, Glacier Micro Brawler, 250 Chase Variants included. I never have gotten a Chase Variant in this fucking box. I've got one in Pro Wrestling Loot. These bosses hate me. Nick Gage and Ron Funches Headlocked Comic Book. Brian Pillman Jr. Autographed 8x10. Awesome Kong, label pin, 100 chase variants included. 
Also, did not get a fucking variant, I don't think. Lucha Bros Brawler Ball. A C3 autograph photo. I figured this would be a variant because he had different color eyes. I don't know, I'll have to look it up. They don't... Oh, it don't say God. if it's a variant on it, does it? Um, it? They usually have a sticker. That's what I'm saying. And I, sometimes I've got a... I guess I have got a variant from them. Um, or no, it wasn't them. It was Pro Wrestling Loot again. Because um, I got... Who was it? Harley Race was my first variant. Yeah, I sold him for 180 bucks. Um, and then I got All Ego Anthony Page. That was like a slight variant, and I sold him for like 45 and 720, like they usually sell for. Um, so yeah, I'm just saying with the different I'll eyes, have, like that. yeah, you have to look up subtleties like the eyes yeah, exactly. See that that's probably not because the fucking eyes. Oh yeah. See what I mean? Yeah. Okay. Since the eyes like that. Yeah. Okay. Now, if you since since all the boxes are the same, does everyone get a variant? Or sometimes like the micro brawlers are different. No, like they're the same they, people, but only certain people get a variant. Yeah, only certain people get a variant, but they'll throw them in random boxes. Like, okay, so you, so just because you might have a variant, don't mean the guy up the street does. No, no okay. not at all. Only it, the same uh, character, just not a variant. Yeah, only I think it's two hundred and fifty people get those. I think that hurricane ones. variant would have been cool. Yeah, the green haired. Yeah, that yeah. would have been fucking. Cool. I got the fucking stupid regular haired one. Um, all right, guys, that's all. Um, we're gonna do. Pro wrestling loot should be shipping here soon. I don't know when he just got up and left. Um, I don't know when it's gonna ship. I'm already complaining to them on Facebook about it because it's ridiculous. Like, it hasn't shipped yet, even today. It's kind of bullshit. Um. But we'll see you guys when that does ship. Take care.